Hi guys, so today on Wendy Wahito, um, we're going to make some other finger foods. We have some lamb over here, short ribs. And today joining me is one of my good friends and one of the very best actors in Kenya, Lenana. <laughs> Hi guys. <laughs> um, we're just gonna uh, marinate this for a bit before we put them in the oven. So basically we just have this spice rub over here. It's just a mixture of different spices that go well with meat. And I think you can find some in the store. And this is just some olive oil just to glaze onto the meat. So Lenana, you're gonna help mm -hmm. me cut up this meat. Yeah, cool. So we're gonna use this um, casserole dish to bake, you know, or rather grill the meat in the oven. I've already preheated my oven to 180 degrees. Um, you should preheat it way before you start make, even making the marinade. So as soon as the marinade is out, you can put in the meat and it will be ready in half an hour. So basically all you need to do is just place the meat on the tray. And then afterwards we can sprinkle the wrap on it. Yeah. So you just need to sprinkle just a little bit. You don't want to put too much because it has some salt, it has some spice to it, but it tastes really, really good. You can also make your own just by mixing good spices like some mixed spice, some salt, some pepper, some oregano, some basil. Just whatever you like on your meat as long as it works for you. Yeah. We're doing good. We're doing good. I'm doing good. You're doing all the hard work. You're just <laughs> sprinkling that powder stuff. This is the important part, yo. <laughs> so just sprinkle it all over. Then take some oil. That's pretty much it, actually. So um, as you all know, Lenana is an actor, so he needs to buff up for the cameras and he needs to eat well for that. But that's, that's not all the time. <laughs> that's just, you know. Yeah, obviously, but your daily food, I bet, is is good food. Yeah. Like good portions. Yeah. You just it, can't it, be... It depends on, like, you know, the, the, the role that I have to play. Yeah. You know, sometimes you have to, you know, slim down instead of buffing up. Yeah. So. Buff is good, though. <laughs> yeah, well, because you're a chick, every <laughs> chick would say that. Yeah, so that's mm. pretty much it. Just leave it to rest for, like, 10 minutes, then you can put it into your oven for half an hour tops. So we're going to put this in the oven. It's rested for about 10 minutes. Um, if it starts burning on the top, just cover it with some foil later on. So next we're gonna make a salad. It's one of my favorite salads. It's called the world of salad. Have you heard of that? No, I haven't. So it's basically just cashew nuts, which are gonna be roasted, some raisins, one large white onion, some lettuce, and mayonnaise. You do the onion. I am not touching that thing. Okay, then do the Yeah, <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's good. That's not too bad, yeah? No, this is fine. Okay. It's better than crying my eyes out as I <laughs> tear the knees apart. So for the onion, you just need to chop it out in round slices. And white onion is very, very good for salad because red onions tend to like be in your face. This one is more subtle. I actually love salad, by the way. Yeah? Love, love salad, yeah. Oh, that's good. It has nothing to do with health or anything like that. I just... Yeah, me too. Love I like the dislike. taste. Yeah. yeah. Although I've never had, you know, one of the cashew nuts and peanuts in mine. Yeah. That's <laughs> so at least you're learning something new. Yeah. My eyes are getting teary now. Ah, there we go. Actually, I can you feel it from here. You jinxed me. Bit. This never I can, happened. Look how close to I am me. to you. I can feel it from here. A little bit, <laughs> you know? I'm just actually, I'm trying to act strong, you know, for the camera. Okay. Just, you, know. you just continue doing that. <laughs> it's going to cry. It's going to fall out over here. And we're also making another salad. Okay. Potato salad. Oh, yes. <laughs> so then we're just oh. going to sprinkle some sultanas. So raisins. What's the difference? Uh, I really don't know, actually. Then after that, you can put any dressing that you want. We're going to use some mayonnaise, but first we're going to roast the cashew nuts. Cashew nuts. Awesome. Okay. 
So we have our pan already heating up. So what you're gonna do is take the cashew nuts mm -hmm. and then just spread them on the pan. Just no like oil or nothing, just no like nothing. that. Oh, okay. Just like that. So just leave them in the pan, then keep tossing them like that for like five, ten minutes, depending on how hot your pan can get. So we just roasted the. I roasted. Okay, he roasted, roasted. the cashew nuts. <coughs> um, it's not a big deal. But <laughs> yeah, he roasted the cashew nuts. So we just add them on to the salad, just like that. Yeah. We have a bit of white vinegar over here. It's just to like clean and give that tangy taste at the same time. Yeah. Now we can add some mayo. I'm gonna put like about two tablespoons of mayo. That's it. Um, we're just gonna put it in the fridge to cool for a bit. Then we're gonna move on to a potato salad. We already, yeah. okay, I already pre-boiled, since we're <laughs> taking rolls over here. I already pre-boiled the potatoes. This is just like five huge potatoes and then I chopped them into cubes and boiled them with some salt water. For the potato salad, it's pretty basic. So have we have salad. some dania here. You just want to take off the roots <coughs> mainly because the stem is where all the flavor is. Just chop it really, really finely. And as you go onto the leaves, try and just twist them so that it can even become more and more fine. So the leaves is not what they use? It is, but the main like flavor comes the from main the... flavor is within the stem. So, Lenana, we saw your acting role in House of Lungula. Yes, yeah. How was that? It was amazing. You, know, you didn't it's... get any shade for being naked on TV. Ah, uh, not so much. No. Obviously, there was a lot of controversy about it being the first over eighteen sex comedy that you know Kenya has done. Apparently, yeah. so I don't know. That's pretty cool. So what else are you doing? Is any Are you having any other upcoming movies? Well, I have this upcoming uh, show that I'm, that I'm going to be doing. Mm -hmm. It's going to be airing in Canada. Ah. So I've been, I've been on a very strict diet because of that. Oh. I'm trying to add some weight. But it doesn't have to be a whole meal. Yeah. I could just have like a snack or something, even just a salad. But I have to eat every two hours. Mm -hmm. And I have to have at least if not at least six to eight meals a day. Wow. Yeah, it's pretty intense. That's a lot of fun, if you ask me. I wish I was an actor. I wish I was a <laughs> chef. Then, you know, I just cook for myself every time, you know. So basically, what I've done right now is just put the dania, coriander, whatever you want to call it, some mayo, then you want to season it as well. That's pretty much it, and then just leave it to cool. So, how many pieces do you want? Five. Well, I'll just start with two. <laughs> you know, just I don't okay. want to. I don't want to make you guys feel bad because this really smells amazing. Bowl of salad. Put some potato. And there you go. That's your healthy meal. Everything is in one plate. It's healthy. It's fun. It tastes good. I'm oh sure it does taste good. That is so good. good I'm gonna try some of this Waldorf. Waldorf? Yeah, Waldorf, Waldorf. salad. Oh, you, you guys don't understand. Oh my god. It's so simple to make. Mm -hmm. So thank you, I've learned a lot. So guys, this is simple. This is delicious, as you can see. Just try it at home, do it your way, my way, whatever. I'm just here to guide you. And I'll see you next time. Peace.